What's up you guys? Welcome back to Mama Yaddy's channel. I'm going to be making some asada green burritos today and they're super fire so stay tuned if you guys want to see how I make this. For this recipe you're going to need tortillas. I got these big ones for the burritos and then some carne ranchera, also some aguacate, the tomatillos and serrano chiles that I already have boiling. I got my beans ready and I'm about to make some rice. Pot warming up already. Gonna put some oil in it. And for this rice, I do kind of use a lot of oil just because we have to brown it for a while. I'm gonna use a scoop of this. Put in there. I like to keep my cuchara in here just so that whenever I need it, it's just ready, you know? And do not let your rice burn. You want it dorado, not quemado. See how it's already starting to brown up? You gotta be careful with that because it's lower sweet up, it'll get burnt quick. So you just gotta keep stirring it, keep an eye on it. This happened to me where you know, this wiggle and it happens and it gets burnt. My tomatillos are almost ready too. So I just turned them off and I'm just gonna cover them, they'll finish cooking. And this is what my rice is looking like. To season it, I'm going to use this steak and meat seasoning and also a lemon. Usually only use one lemon, but usually I only make two pounds of meat, but today it's more like I have got four, but since I threw all that away, it's probably just like three, so I'm just going to go ahead and add another lemon. Plus this one was kind of like hard to squeeze, so. And mix it all again. I had already washed my hands once. More than once. I hate having my hands dirty. I always me las ando lavando every time I'm cooking. Like if I get something on it, I'm like me acabo rápido. Add 
I don't even put any oil on this. I just cover it up with the heat and it'll start cooking. This is almost ready. Mmm, smells so bomb. I got my tomatillos and my serranos up in here. I'm gonna mix them up and then I'm gonna add the salt because it's not bien lleno. I'm gonna taste it to see if it's falta sal or if I should put some more. Oh, it's bomb. But I do need to put a little bit more salt, but I mean like the spice, bomb. Okay, let's look at our meat. And I feel like my salsa has a perfect consistency. You see, I don't like it too runny, but not too thick either. Like, I think it's perfect. Okay, so now I'm gonna put the salsa. And the queso. So about the queso, we grew up eating it with this because my mom makes it with this queso, but I prefer mine with the other cheese. gonna package these up because these are not for me. Mmm, look at that bombness. I'm not 
All right, so for myself, I made a smaller version. I just used the regular size tortillas. And I'm gonna use this cheese instead of the other one. So I was gonna use this cheese you guys and I'm so glad that I smelled it before I put it on my burrito. So I'm just gonna go ahead and throw it out. And I just went ahead and I used the other cheese. And this is what my burrito's looking like. Mmm, so fire. I'm gonna let it cool down a little bit before I do the taste test because no me quiero quemar. Alright you guys, time for the taste test. so good I didn't even want to like talk before I was done with my bite and then you grab a piece of aguacate mm. I kid you not this is fuego you guys super fire hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe to my channel I'm gonna go ahead and enjoy the rest of my burrito so see y'all later